Good Tuesday morning, everybody. We have uh, got a cold front moving through the Brazos Valley right now. And depending on where you are, you've already felt the effects of that. And some of us are getting some pretty good rains from it. Others, not so much. So scattered showers continue anywhere from just about south of Caldwell along through Somerville up through Snook and continuing to move off to the south and east here. So northern county is not looking at a whole lot as of right now. You got most of your rain earlier today. So some pretty good rain moving through Brenham right now and uh, through the Snook area, as well as maybe as far north as uh, South College Station as we see all this moving off, again, to the south and east. That is along the leading edge of that cold front. So just about all of us are looking at cooler temps now, and we're going to try to fight back to the low 60s later this afternoon. I think we'll be hanging around right about 55 to 58 through most of the day today. So we'll try again to get back to about 60 this afternoon. Better chance of that the farther south you are. North winds around 10 to 20. Might as well get used to that for at least the next couple of days as we see that continue into tomorrow as well. So there's your pinpoint forecast going through the rest of the day. Could we see some sunshine? Yes, but I wouldn't count on seeing a whole lot of that, though. As we go into tonight, more showers look possible, even some uh, light to moderate rainfall here for us as we are waking up on our Wednesday. And then I think it turns more to the drizzle and kind of mistiness as we go in through the rest of the day. So you see a lot of green there. Will we pick up a lot of rainfall? That remains to be seen. But there's potential that some of us get up to about three quarters of an inch. So definitely not going to hurt, but uh, likely not going to see a whole lot of heavy rain as we go into tomorrow. You couple that though with the lows tonight in the mid to low 40s, lots of cloud cover and north wind around 10 to 20, and it will be mighty chilly as we go into tomorrow. Highs try to get back up to 50, some of us only in the upper 40s. We'll get a little bit warmer as we go into Thursday, and I think we could see a little bit of shower activity as we start the day as well. Friday, Saturday, and Sunday, we're talking much, much nicer conditions, but lows a little bit colder in the mid to upper 30s as we're waking up Friday, Saturday, Sunday mornings with highs in the low to mid 60s.